Who do you think is going to be the wiser head here? President Trump or President Putin? Well, <clears throat> you see, first of all, the leaders should come together and talk. Talk to each other. But we have to <laughs> reverse the situation and get back to talking to each other. And then a collective wisdom will take, out, will take over. You think they can talk together? Uh, yes. But would you describe yourselves as peacemakers? Yes. Really? Yes. I your, have no doubt. Your country has warned there will be consequences for the airstrikes against Syria. What will those consequences be? It depends whether they would proceed and how they would proceed. Well, the promise has been yes. to proceed if there is a more chemical weapons strikes. So. Uh, first of all, let's uh, be clear. As we believe, if there would be new fakes about chemical weapon strikes. And Can you just repeat that? Sorry. Where, whether there would be another fakes, fake, fake news about chemical weapon strikes. Because uh, actually, I'd like to uh, ask, maybe not particularly you, but maybe someone could explain to me why there was and what, what was the necessity, severe, this uh, necessity to conduct air strikes? just day before the experts from OPCW were to arrive in uh, Syria. What do you think the answer is? You know, I'm not the person to ask. <laughs> yes. yes, sure. And uh, as up to uh, Russian side, we believe the one of the purposes, actually, the, we, we see there a lot of purposes, but one of the purposes was to obstruct the work of the specialists of OPCW. Right. So, it, to what end? Why? Why? Because, well, they would prove there was no chemical attack and everything was faked. Another fake, like one year ago.